السلام عليكم. Welcome to our fifth math online lesson for grade four. This is Ms. Fatima Bilhaj, and today is April 13th, 2020. Today we're starting from question 32. It says, divide the following numbers in two different methods. Let's watch this video. First, let's divide 32 by 2. I'm going to draw a number line from 0 to 32, but I'm only going to highlight some steps. From 0 to 20, because 20 is a multiple of 2, and from 20 to 30, and from 30, just 2 more to 32. From 0 to 20, I know that there are 20 steps there. Twenty steps means there are ten twos within this jump. And from twenty to thirty, there are ten steps. And ten steps from twenty to thirty means there are five twos. And just one two from thirty to thirty-two. Now, ten twos, five twos, and one two. Together there are 16 because 10 plus 5 plus 1 is equal to 16. Second strategy is again dividing 32 by 2. I'm going to partition in this strategy 32 into two multiples of 2. I can partition it into 10 and 22. They're both multiples of 2. And I can choose any other numbers. Uh, for example, I can choose 12 and 20. That would be easier. Since I was originally dividing by 2, I'm going to divide these uh, uh, two multiples by 2. 12 divided by 2 and 20 divided by 2. 12 divided by 2 is equal to 6 and 20 divided by 2 is equal to 10. And 6 plus 10 is equal to 16. There we go. We got the same answers for both strategies. Now 78 divided by 6, again I'm going to draw a few steps, I'm going to reach over 60 because there are 10 sixes there and from 60 to 78 that's 18 more steps and in 18, those 18 steps we have 3 sixes. So 6 plus 3 is equal to 13, 78 divided by 6 is equal to 13. Second strategy is partitioning 78 into two multiples of 6. I can partition 78 into 48 and 30. They will be both equal to 78 and I can divide both by 6. What's 6 divided by 48 divided by 6 and 30 divided by 6? That's 8 plus 5, which is 13. So I got the same answer one more time. I can choose other two multiples. I can, for example, choose... Um, 60 and 18, like how I chose in the first uh, in the first strategy. 60 by 6 is 10, and 18 by 6 is 3, again 13. For question 34, use partitioning to double or halve these three digit numbers. We're going to start from 123. I need to double 123. And in order to do that, first let's partition 123 into hundreds tens and units that is 100 plus 20 plus 3 now let's double each one 100 doubled or double 100 is 200 double 20 is 40 and double 3 is 6 now let's add them uh, together we get 246 so double 123 is equal to 246 Next is half 498. Uh, first, let's partition 498 into 400 plus 90 plus 8, and let's divide each by 2. 400 divided by 2 is 200, 90 divided by 2 is 45, and 80 divided by 2 is 4. So half of 498 is equal to 249. Now let's partition 154 uh, because I need to double it. 154 is equal to 100 plus 50 plus 4 
and multiplying each by 2, we get 200 plus 100 plus 8. And when we add them all together, we get 308. Let's halve 566. Partition it first into 500 plus 60 plus 6 and divide each by 2. 500 divided by 2 is 250. 60 divided by 2 is 30. And 6 divided by, th by 2 is 3. Add these together, we get 283. So half of 566 is equal to 283. So this is the end of our revision questions, guys. I'll see you next time with new lessons. Take care.